I mean, a group of women in Nairobi has held demonstrations to the Ministry of Education headquarters demanding the arrest and prosecution of perpetrators of the alleged defilement of a student at Moy Girls. Marching along the streets of Nairobi to Jogo House, the women want the Education Cabinet Secretary Ambassador Amina Mohammed to ensure the investigations are expedited. Students of the National School returned to the institution yesterday after a one-week break. The Directorate of Criminal Investigations has in the meantime been pursuing collection and analysis of DNA samples from male teachers and staff at the school in a bid to nab the suspect. The Education Cabinet Secretary Amina Mohammed on Saturday appointed a nine-member interim board to manage the school. We want them to speak on rape cases. Wale wananajisiwa ni watoto wetu, wanawake wetu, na madada zetu. It is not an issue for women only. Women power! As an individual and as a rape survivor, it's a very personal fight and I come here to speak not because someone has told me to but because I know what it means to go through that and I know what it means when you have to live with, the, with everything that happens to you after this. So for me, fundamentally, uh, justice for these girls is justice for all girls across the world and so it's important that we, they, they are able to hear us, to listen to us and most importantly arrest, arrest the perpetrators and be able to put them to justice. Rape is evil and is, it is bad regardless whether it is taking place in schools or in the wider society it is bad and uh, we as the ministry uh, we assure you that action is being taken we may not be telling you everything whatever is happening but uh, action is being taken to address the situation and you'll be seeing the uh, the results <laughs>